Okay, hello my Stone Crush Army, and welcome back to another video. And as you can see, we are playing Subnautica, and this is episode 3 actually. And as you can see, we are getting right into it. Um, so last episode we made a lot of progress. What? Oh, that's that age research thing. We went to the, um, the base that Sam, that our sister Sam was on. Um, what else did we make? We made a, a couple of things. We made like the module depth fabricator, or like the extra, um, the extra depth for the sea truck because, ah, those guys from the last episode. Um, we were actually on our way to the pilot's last known position and, god, those guys are so creepy. Uh, last time we went there, we, um, we couldn't just go all the ways down because, you know, our depth was only 150, so now we're gonna go there and see what we can find. Um, so I'm just gonna speed up there, I just wanted to do the intro, so I'll see you guys in just a second. Okay, and we're back, guys. I just wanted to do a sped up time lapse for you guys. Um, so I hope that you guys enjoyed that little me freaking out on things. I wanted to record uh, getting here, or like kind of just exploring this area because he has alien tech from the last game, also from the last episode. Because if you guys, what are you? You are creepy and ugly. I am getting out of here. Um, this was just the pilot's last known position, but I don't be anything. Yeah, I just. I... All right, this is um really creepy. This was the pilot's last known position, so let's just do a little bit of exploration. I think this is the um. The lily pad biome, yeah, because of the, uh, the, uh, the whale, the glow whales. Okay, let's just go a little deeper, see if we can find something like that, part of a ship. A Detecting bow of an astronautical Soltrans go vessel nearby. Vessel name, Mercury 2. Is this this? Inoperative. Yeah, you think... Is this- I'm wondering if this is the same one from the previous episode. No, it's not. This is the- oh, this is- this is- this has to be the other half of the ship that we found last time because this is below 150 meters, so we would have never seen this without the depth module. Wow, this ship has been here- this ship has probably been here longer than the sunrise from the last game, the one that we crashed on. Okay, let's, um, let's take a look, see if there's, like, an entrance or something, and a lot of good things for titanium, too. Um, get up your, um, uh, oh, sorry about that, buddy. Wow, this looks like part of the, uh, that Altera ship that we crashed on last time. Is there an entrance, like, anywhere? I do not know of an entrance. Um, okay, hold on. Let's uh, keep let's keep on looking, see what we can find. Do not do that. Ah, Jesus! Uh, stupid broken lily pads. I am not. Oh, hey, whoa, that. Mm. Hi there, buddy. I know what. Passing one hundred meters. Wrong suit fragment. Let's go. Decreased. One out of four. Okay. I found an entrance, guys. Oh, this is where we get the prawn suit! Or at least hopefully. Okay, luckily there's oxygen things in here. Prawn suit fragments. So we just need three, one more after this. Okay, then. Prawn suit drill arm fragment. That's good to have for drilling big parts of the prawn suit. Um... Open to act so, like, 
Uh, I'm thinking it means a laser cutter. Um, okay, uh, okay, here's the other drill fragment I guess we needed. Well, I was not expecting this. Okay, hold on. Let's get back to our sea truck. Get some oxygen real quick. Oh, sorry, sea truck. Okay. Let's just bring this in here for us, for oxygen. Okay, let's, uh, let's park her right here. Uh, let's actually just prepare her. Um, also, we need a name for our seed truck, guys. Because we all, we always named our things from the last, uh, series, but now we need to, um, we need to name our prawn suit. Uh, or not a prawn suit, our seed truck. I think of a name for her, guys. Okay, I am not being anything. I think we need, yeah, we need the laser cutter, which we don't have. We have fragments of it, but not the actual thing, and that bothers me, because I think we need the laser cutter for most of the things in here. Okay, hold on. Let's, um, get back our sea truck, our nice little sea truck. She's awesome. Oh, sorry. Um, let's go back. God. You're, are you after me? No! Leave me alone! Bad squid shark thing. Okay, is there... Is that an entrance? No, okay. Oh, let's just check down. Ooh! There is an entrance. Okay, let's save the game. Because, you know, never hurts to save too early, guys. Please wait. Okay, let's get out of here. Hello? Is there anyone here? Hello? I got... Ooh! Nuclear reactor fragment. Okay. That's the... Oh, PDA! I'm alive. Stefano saved me. The Mercury attempted an emergency takeoff and... Everything seemed fine. I was helping the bridge crew with the emergency takeoff since the crew is, well, was shorthanded because of everything. I heard the sound of metal tearing and for a split second, everything was tinged bright green and unbearably hot. Then I saw daylight and I was looking down at the ocean and ice. The strongest wind I've ever felt roared in my ears ripping through the ship people went flying out the side of the mercury so much screaming and chaos i was lucky i had just clipped into my sea tinker stephanos came out of nowhere like a malaika an angel i felt his rough calloused hand grasp mine with the gentlest of urgency it felt like time slowed he said i gotcha just follow me ella i don't know how but he used an emergency tether to drag me to the nuclear reactor core, the strongest bulkhead in the ship. We hit the water and everything went black. <sighs> He's sleeping. I think he might have hit his head. I'm exhausted. The adrenaline has long since worn off and my body aches. I think I might have fractured the rib. I'm gonna shut my eyes for a bit. When I wake up, I'll figure this out. I'll save us. Okay, then that. I guess this is the Mercury 2. I think this is the other part of the Mercury 2. Um, it looks like this is where we get the prawn suit fragment, which we have three out of the four, which is good. Yeah, oh, yep. <laughs> There's the name of it, the Mercury 2. Wow, I am. Um... Hey. Don't do that. Um, I guess we could just keep doing some exploring around, guys. Um, I want to. Okay, it looks like we can't go any deeper that way, which means that there's probably something down there, but we just don't have the depth for it right now. So those people on the Mercury Two are probably all dead. Sad to say, but it's true. Uh, that's probably what happened. Um. So it looks like we need a laser cutter to get the last prawn suit fragment from 
from what it looks like, at least. Um, well, we got some titanium because, as you can see in my inventory, guys, or right here, I have the habitat builder. I we can start building a real base. Um, so yeah, let's just do some a little bit of exploring. See if there's anything else that we interesting that we can find. Anything down here? Oh, nope. Doesn't look like it. Um, we may always just come back around on a live stream, just exploring the ocean. Seeing if there's anything to find. Um, but other than that, this, this, this is definitely... That wasn't nice. This definitely is There's a large anomalous mass of rock that has broken away and risen above the surrounding terrain. Uh, okay then. The heck does that mean? Um. Yeah, okay. Is there like a, an island above us or something? Hold on, let's... Let's get above us. Let's get above onto the water. Let's see if there's... Any, because this is definitely the lily pad biome. Yeah, nope, just lily pads. Okay, um... Oh, hey, it's the glow whales, my buddies. There's my buddies, the glow whales. My buddy. Um, yeah, okay. You're cool. I like you. You're my friend now. We're having some tacos later. See, you, yeah, you like that, don't you? Okay, hey, no, 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 ha, get, get, you done. Hey, leave me alone. Okay, I think that's it right now for the lily pad biome. We'll just go down here. Um, we're probably gonna head back to the base, so I'm just gonna do a quick jump cut and, um, head back to the base. I'll let you know if we find anything on the way there. So I'll see you guys back at the base. I implore you to investigate. Will this help us build you a body? I do not know what we will find. I just know it is important. Uh, uh, okay, so we're back. Security location uploaded to <clears throat> EA. I was about to start building a base, actually, guys, because we made it, um... We made it back to the base after exploring, you know, the pilot's last known position. Um, and I was just gathering... Oop. What happened? Ah, uh, yes, S. I was just... Jesus. I was just gathering some resources to be able to build our first base in the game. I actually had an idea of where I wanted to build it. I just need some ports. But then... I didn't want to do that like on camera and stuff. Um, I don't know if you guys like that stuff or not. But, um... Um, then that started playing. I was like, crap, I gotta start again, you know? Warning. Passing 100 meters. Oxygen um, efficiency decreased. So, yeah. Let's just, uh, keep on going. Looking for, looking for some quartzy quartz. There we go. Because we need the quartz for glass and stuff like that. Um, but once... Oh, hey, 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 hey. Be nice, be nice. Um... Once we get the quartz that we need, we should be able to build our base how we want. Oh, yeah. See, this is where you have to go to get diamonds when we're not going down. That's, that's just too scary. Okay, I think we're good for right now. Let's head back to our base. Ignoring. You know what? Screw it. We're gonna do it. We're gonna scan the blue chart. Hey, 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 monkey, 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 be nice, be nice, be nice. Haha, <laughs> we did it, we did it, we did it. That was scary, but we did it. Okay, we need to go get some oxygen. You know, before we, you know, die of no breathing. Um, and I was actually thinking about building our first base, guys, in this area over here. Because I think it's just a very cool area to build a base in. Ooh, okay. What is that rumbling noise I'm hearing? 
coming from that direction, and I don't know what it is. I don't know if it's like a creature, is it volcanic activity? Like, is there a lava zone to go to like there was in the last game? I'm not too, too sure, guys. Okay. So now that we got that, I also changed out one of the batteries, too. Um, okay. So let's go over here. Um, let's just get the basic building done and out of the way. Um, before we worry about like, the interior detail. And I'm thinking probably right to start the base right about here. Um, okay, so let's start with the multi-purpose room, which, you know, obviously pretty good. Okay, I'm gonna start here. You know, just start up basic and simple, nothing too complicated. Okay, um, now we need a hatch. Okay, now our, our base has a hatch. We need, ooh, we need copper back at the base. Okay, let's go back, get some copper real quick. Um, so yeah, if you guys are enjoying these videos and what I'm doing, please don't forget to like and subscribe, and also share the video with your friends if you think, uh, it's like, hey, this stone crusher guy, he's pretty dumb and funny when he plays Subnautica. Let me show my friend this, and maybe he'll like it. You know? It doesn't hurt to try, guys. And I appreciate all the support on the last videos, uh, last couple videos, too. It, it actually means a lot to me to see that you guys are enjoying this, and it, it makes me happy. It, it really does. Um, so thank you guys for all your support. Um, okay. But anyways, back to business. We need lithium for reinforcements. We also need to make a beacon, actually, so we know where our base is. Um, how do you... Can we make a beacon? Okay, good. We can make a beacon. Whew! Use beacons to mark traverse territory. Show or hide the signals of your choice with your Xenoworks PDA. Oh, thanks. Uh, now with surface support. I'll call her Karen, because, you know, that's because I can. Okay. Come down here. Uh, we're just gonna place that right there. Edit beacon name. This is gonna be... Oops. Main base. Oh, not 12, 1. There we go. So now we won't ever lose our base. If we get far away, we can just go back. Okay. So now that we have this, let's put this tool back here. And grab our builder tool and grab our solar panels like that. Uh, there we go. Now we got power, people. I'm gonna get some more power just in case. And this is just temporary power. power. Restored. All primary systems online. Ah, I love hearing that. Oh, it's so satisfying. Um, okay. So let's just start off with a simple base right now. This is just Welcome aboard, Captain. Oh, I'm the captain, are we? Uh we can also make a bioreactor too, which I probably will make for power. Um, but I wanted to worry about making a fabricator. So now we can actually craft stuff while we're here um and then we just need to make some basic simple storage which it's not too too bad not at all and we're not gonna move everything on camera guys we'll i'll do that later um okay so it looks like it's only three for a wall uh what else what else what else uh we're definitely gonna want to want to make the battery charger which we could actually make right now and start charging batteries, but I'm not too, too worried about that. Um, I actually need to go back in here and uh, put this stuff away, just like that. We will make a battery charger later, because we are definitely gonna need it. But what I want to do is head to that alien signal, or the alien artifact or whatever, because um, I am curious of where it's gonna take us, what biome it's in, but, it, oh, oh, hold on. Grab trap. Do we have all of the necessary pieces for this? Uh, yes, we do. We'll keep that titanium. It's a tough one for building, guys. But anyways, um... So I'm wondering, like, what biome this will take us to. Oh, excuse me, fishies. Uh, I'm also a little scared. 
Okay, so it looks like it's taking us over here. Um, I don't know like how far down it is. I don't even know if we can get to it. It's underground. How do we... Well, there's a base thing over here. Ooh, and I think we found our... In no, we did not find our entrance, but hold on, let's, um, take a look at this guy, see if there's anything here to scan. Um, I guess we'll take that for right now. Ooh, what's this? Ah, we must have already had it, whatever it was. Ah, here. Ooh, okay, hold on, I, f I see the entrance, guys. Um, oh, yeah, that's weird. Um, uh, okay. So I have never actually been over here in this area, so I'm kind of curious on what's over here. Thanks to the sea truck actually now having oh, nuggets. That's gonna do some damage if it hits. Oh. Okay. We gotta get down. Uh, okay, I think. I think we are lost, guys. I'm going to- I'm going to be the first person to admit that. We're lost. I have no idea where the hell I'm going or what the heck I'm doing. Um... This- okay, maybe it's... Because it's right here, but I don't know how to get to it, you know? Like, is there a specific way, or... I'm a little confuzzled, guys. That's all. Um, maybe this way? Maybe we can get to it this way. Um, like I said, I'm not too, too sure. I don't even know if this, if we're going the correct direction. Which we might be? I, like I said, I'm not too sure, guys. But it's just being here with the sea truck is dangerous, but it's kind of... <gasps> Ooh, I cannot fit the sea truck down there. Hold on, guys. Warning. Passing 100 okay. meters. Let's oxygen repair our sea truck. Decreased. Okay, get in here. Fill up our oxygen. Okay. Yes! What is... What you found is more than just an artifact. It will help me follow the traces my people left on this planet. I'm glad it could help. I know you would still prefer me to have a corporeal form of my own. Well, yes. If you continue searching, I may regain some of my connection to the network, piece by piece. Okay, so we found it. That's good, that's good, good. Okay. Uh... Is that... Is that the last fragment that we need? To the... To the laser cutter? I think it is! This is a, oh, hi there. Thank you. Thank you, little sea monkey. You're so freaking cute. Oh, I didn't know that they brought you things. That's cool. Okay, anyways, guys, let's, uh, oh. The sea monkeys have changed their tune. If only I could let them know what I need. How do your people communicate if you are not networked? What do you mean? We just talk to each other. Do you not find that primitive? We exist as data. We are all aware of each other's thoughts and needs. Scientific endeavors are accomplished much more smoothly this way. There's more to life than research, Alan. I can't lie. Work would go faster if I could read my colleagues' minds, but thoughts are private, and people have their own inner lives. People change and need space to think. Space helps you think. I find that being separated from my network is very quiet. What, what do you mean by quiet? Imagine a thousand strings, each playing its own range of notes, none louder than the others. Each one builds harmony, a continuous thrum in the background of existence. I am now a lone string in search of familiar harmonies. I'll help you find them. Okay then, so it looks like we found what Alan was looking for, so that's good. We also got some resources. I also started getting out and collecting the cords because I needed them. Um, 
This is a interesting area over here, but we'll uh we'll save this for later. Thank you, Mr. Titan Holdfish. Okay, let's just uh get back to our base and finish building it. Um so I'll just do a jump cut and I'll see you guys there. Okay, landing back to base. So I think that it's time that we gather some more titanium from over at our main base. And actually extend what we want to build. Um, so yeah, let's gather some titanium from our S storage. No, I don't want to edit. I want to open. Jesus, thank you. Um, we need two silver. Because um, we actually, I want to make that battery chargers to charge these batteries because they're dead they're like dead dead um and we can also make a laser cutter but we need diamonds yay storage solution which shares contained with all other what the hell the hell is that uh, i'm not gonna worry about that and let's make a wiring kit like we need Okay, so we made a wiring kit, which is good, which is good. Um, I also wanted to make some glass. Okay, we made the glass that we need. Um, let's grab more titanium. Should probably also grab more lithium when we get a chance, but can't do that right now. Just looking to see if there's anything else we need. So I think we're gonna finish off making our base and we'll end off the episode. It's been a pretty good episode. We uh, explored some areas and etc. Um, so yeah. And I just get right over here to our first ever main base. Whoop whoop. So excited. Okay. So what I want to have. Yes, glass. I think this would be cool. Oh. Oh, I don't have enough. Wait, stop. No, I want to deconstruct. Oh, let me get some glass. Or some more cool. I need lots of quartz. I need to get, like, the prawn suit again and then, like, find, like, one of those quartz. Quartz deposits or whatever. No, I don't need those right now. Oh, I'm gonna start the hunt for quartz, guys. Okay, and we got the quartz that we need, so now we can finish actually making the base. Wow, Welcome it is aboard, Captain. right in here. I wish we could change that. Uh, but anyways, wow. Whew. That's, so that's one. Okay, so we have enough for two more connectors, which is what we need. So we could have a um I'm just trying to think guys of what we can do. Connect that like that. Uh this like so. Ooh, this is also why I, I brought lithium to because we need to strengthen our base hold. I put them in... Which is this one. 
in case we also hold on guys before I forget uh, let's make our battery charger set that right there perfect now we have a battery charger I need to put uh, these batteries in it switch this one out and put that one in it there we go so now we have a battery charger really perfect it's actually really good guys and then it's like we can make connections off of these two and then down there what I need to do is just add whole two whole reinforcements here yeah that'll that'll make it go up pretty quickly there you go um oh don't have the lithium that's fine okay so we just uh, it's so frustrating sometimes when you keep when you think you have enough of the thing that you need but in reality you don't I'm just bust waiting warning passing 100 meters oxygen efficiency decreased Got that that got that got that More glass. Wow, that charges them batteries fast. Look at that. If I look away, huh? Thought it actually did go up, which is kind of funny. Okay. So now we can build the last one that we want. Build another multi-purpose room here. And then take two titanium, go this way, and this way, like so, build another multi-purpose room. We're going to build one more multi-purpose room. If I had the, I should have, the, yeah, I should have enough. Ooh, are we missing one titanium? Oh, hold on, we need more titanium. I hope we have more titanium. I don't know if we have any more titanium. Okay, uh, is that enough? Oh, we need two more titanium. Ugh. Gosh. Titanium. Lead. Copper. I need titanium. Give me titanium. 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 There we go. Got it. Okay. So now our base is, well, the exterior is now complete at least. Uh, what I would like to do is actually add an observatory uh, at the end of this, like probably like right here, but that requires a um, special fancy glass we don't have. Um, so yeah, so this is kind of a different episode. Um, it was mainly just building the base and everything. But if you guys did enjoy today's video, um, the only thing I'm going to do probably between this episode and next episode is um, gather plenty of titanium resources, quartz, copper, stuff like that for the next episode. So uh, we can make the interior, like make like the bioreactor, um, and then um, just stuff like that. Also, I'm going to do all the off-camera stuff and... Um, um, and like move everything over from the the life pod over to here. I'll probably make one of these my room or something, you know, put up decoration, like, for just purposes that I want, you know. Definitely gonna make this, like, the cooking room, not the cooking room. Um, the, what's the word I'm looking for? power room where like bio 
final mess thing will go. Um, but other than that, yeah, I think that's it. We just <laughs> looks like a big X, kind of. If we extended it out a little bit, but it looks it looks fine, guys. I, I'm I really do like it the way that it is now. Um, but if you guys did enjoy today's video, please don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe to become part of the Stone Crush Army. And you guys, have to, if you guys also have any suggestions to what we should add, if we should add like a second floor or something like that, uh, please let me know. But other than that, thank you guys so much for stopping by, and please don't forget to hit that bell icon, ding, because every time you do, I, I, uh, you guys get notifications when I go live or upload like this video. And don't forget to share with your friends. But other than that, I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye. Whoa, 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 whoa. Before you guys click off of the video, I wanted to say thank you guys for all the support of me coming back, and hopefully you guys are enjoying some Nautica. But at the bottom right of your screen, you can see the last video, so please go give that some love. And at the top left of your screen, you can see where to subscribe. Just so you guys know, I'm trying to post at least two videos a week now with Subnautica and other games, but Subnautica is going to be the big focus for the next uh, two or three weeks or so to play through the game. Other than that, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video.